Hello Internet, what's up? Today is another VEDA day, and let me just say I have a couple things to tell you. Um, first off, I've been working on organizing my desk. Now, it's still a little bit crazy, but I did move my ivy, I got an ivy plant with like this really cool pot, which I guess you can't see, but it's like a self-watering, awesome, oh, fail, pot. Um, and then I got some new shorts. So if you watched my like wardrobe video, you oh you can't even see these. Too bad. I got some awesome like blue shorts, and then I got some awesome red shorts too. So my wardrobe for summer is completely complete, except for I need one pair of like blue shoes. So I'm thinking about some Vans. I saw some really cool shoes I like. That'll probably be what I get. Other than that, there is uh, nothing really new going on with me, except I'm going to be um, sent to a drive through store um, net most of next week to work at that for more ASM training. If you didn't know, I work for Starbucks, and I am trying to move up in the company, so I have some extra training I have to do, so I'm working on that, and um, that's really the big stuff going on with me. I might buy a condo. Possibly, maybe, if I can pay off all of my school debt soon, which um, I graduated in December. So I really think I have like another year to like pay. If I can like hardcore pay off my student loans, um, which I have three student loans, but they're all really pretty low, relatively low. I, I don't owe hardly anything compared to like a, another like college grad, bachelor graduate. Um, so I can pay it all off within a year, but I might like actually buy a condo in um, July, which I found the condo. It's ninety thousand, but the mortgage payment is actually less than what I pay for my apartment right now. So why like throw away money um, renting if I could like pay to own? You know what I mean? So that's something I'm currently thinking about. I'm really excited about it because like I could own a condo. But, of course, there's positive and negatives associated with everything. Like, if I have a condo, then I have no backyard. That's, like, mine. Um, if I own, then I have to worry more about the maintenance rather than just, like, calling the apartment manager. Um, and also, the resale value of a condo is a lot less than, like, a house. So I'd have to be a little bit more concerned with, like, if... I whenever I decide to sell because I probably won't like live there forever um, these days everyone has like multiple careers and multiple houses that they live in in their lifetime so I have to think about all those things but the positives would be wow I will have this like major investment that will hopefully be able to pay off like I will have something to show for the amount of time and the amount of money that I have put into a place that I've resided um, because the past two years I've just been living in Austin and renting and I have nothing to show for it other than, well, I know Austin, you know, I've lived here. Um, other than that, I don't really have anything to show for it. It's just been money down the drain, really, in, into someone else's pocket. So that's something I'm considering. Um, I'm going to try to pay back my student loans, pay my rent, and hopefully save up a down payment. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I'm also thinking about getting another puppy. So I know all this money, money, money is really what's on my mind. Can I afford these things? Is my cost of living, am I intentionally increasing it beyond my, um, beyond my means? So I don't know. Are any of you viewers, are, are y'all homeowners? Do you have a condo? Do you have a house? Do you have any advice for me? looking into this like I found the condo that I want that I and it's 90,000 um, what do you think about that do you think it's a good idea do you think it's a good investment a condo um, what are the positive and negatives that you see right off the bat for me as a new you know home potential home buyer potential homeowner of a condo let me know in the comments box below. I cannot wait to read your comments. I'm really excited. I'm really anxious. I'm really excited. All those things uh, that come with change. I'm scared. Oh, 
So anyway, let me know, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.